Hi, this is Johan speaking. In this uh, video, I'm going to show you this new game source code called Flappy Bird Smasher. The game mechanics are very simple and very addictive. It's basically the pipes and you need to basically smash all those birds. Okay, and if one of those birds happen to pass the pipes, then the player loses. All right, so let's give a live demo. I'm going to press play and tap. As you can see, whenever I click on the screen, I control the pipes. And here, I gotta make sure to kill all those animals, okay? And every time I kill the birds, I get one extra point. If I happen to kill two or three birds at the same time, I get more bonus points, okay? So I'm just gonna lose so to show you. Okay, so that's basically how the game is all about. Okay, very simple. Anyone can just pick it up right away and very addictive. Now, the beauty of this, it's, uh, it's based on the Flappy Croco source code, which basically many of you are already familiar with, and it's a very well-known source code that it's extremely easy to risk in and uh, very um, profitable source code. So I'm gonna show you a live way of um, changing the game graphics. So um, depending on which, um, which pack you bought, you probably have uh, the game graphics and uh, some uh, game graphic packs that came with it, okay? So I actually downloaded them and put them inside of this folder, the packs folder, okay? So as you can see, there's some, um, there's a set of five dragons and five birds, okay? So let me show you, those are the birds, the ones are already within the game, all right? As you can see. And then you have also sets of dragons right here. So what I'm going to do right now is actually change the dragons uh, change the uh, the birds to dragons okay so let me show you here I have dragons right here all right so those are the ones I'm gonna be using um, now pretty straightforward how do you do it just go to Xcode right click on the project show in finder okay once you're there you go to resources assets textures and right here you need to change character one two three and four how do you change them just click right there go to the folder where you downloaded the graphic packs and I'm going to take the first dragon and I'm going to copy the crocodile folder command C to copy then I'm going to go to the source code and within that I'm just going to paste that okay so I'm going to select those two copy them okay and paste them in character one all right command V to paste and it's asking me if I want to replace them yes apply to all replace all right so that's it for my character one I'm going to do the same thing for my character too. So I'm going to take the second dragon. All right. And I'm going to paste it right there. In the second dragon. Replace all. Now I'm going to do the same thing for the, the, the third bird that's replaced by another dragon. All right. So character three, command V. Replace all. And the last one, I'm going to take dragon four. All right. I'm going to copy those and paste them right here apply to all replace all right now what i'm going to do is also change the background so this is the background image i'm going to replace it by one of the background images that comes with the pack all right so you have the graphic pack here it says um background background smasher packs i'm going to take um the um cd toxic all right i'm going to take this one so command c and then just gonna go here and in texture command V to paste it and I want to replace yes replace all right and um, that's pretty much all I wanted to replace now one more thing I want to replace is the logo I want to change from flappy bird to uh, to uh, um, to flappy dragon so I happened to create it before but uh, you don't have to change that you just have to basically um, you can also remove it if you don't want that okay but you may have to create that yourself okay so I'm just gonna rename that to fp okay just fp.png oh it's already there so just gonna remove this one then okay and rename this one fp.png all right now i'm gonna copy it command c and i'm gonna come here and go to the gui and command v to paste and replace the one that's already there and that's it at this point i am done with my reskin i'm going back to xcode Changing the name of the uh, bundle display from Flappy Birds to Flappy Dragons, okay? 
and I'm going to do the exact same thing for the bundle display name and the bundle name. There we go. And at this point, I am done. So I'm going to do a product clean, and then I'm going to do a product build. Okay, we got a build succeeded, and now we have the ad and the game center that I'm going to close. And as you can see, we have the new background with the new logo. And uh, let's get to play and see if we get the new dragons there. All right, let's go. Excellent. Dragons are here. Everything works seamlessly. Isn't it beautiful? I just made a video game in just a couple minutes. All right. So far, so good. I'm just going to stop there. It's very addictive. I feel like playing, but I'm just going to stop here. All right. So as you can see, it's very easy. As easy as just drag and drop game assets. Now, let me show you a little bit more of things you can do with it. If you look at the source code and you go to the folder Flappy Game Scene, there's this um, file here called Flappy Gameplay Layer.cpp. If you open this one and you go all the way to the top, you can see that you can play with the variable. You can see what is the main character initial speed. So what is the, the speed of those, um, those birds or those dragons? The speed right now is four, but you can make it a lot faster. You can make it to 10, okay? You can change the number of enemies that arrive in waves. Instead of waves of four, you can do waves of 10 or waves of 20. Okay, and the time between each wave, instead of 2.4 seconds, you can do waves of 10 seconds, and so on. So, as you can see, there's lots of things that can be tweaked for you to make um, a, a unique experience. Okay, and again, you have plenty of amazing uh, graphic packs. Okay, right now, I only use the Toxic City, but as you can see, you have uh, the Fire Police background, then you have uh, Greener Grass, then you have Red Dreams, and then you have also a red planet, like if you're in the sky. Uh, and then a bunch of different dragons. I did not use them all. I did not use this one right there. Same thing with uh, the birds. So um, let me show you also the pipes right here, okay? So you do have sets of pipes ready to use, okay? I did not change the pipes, but just know that you have unique pipes right here, okay? And you even have a block here, okay? So it's even different here. Okay, so now your imagination is the limit. Go ahead and make some amazing games. Thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you on appsfresh.com.